Hello, this is Dango1867. Hope you're all feeling alright today because I am Tickety Boo. We've got the Sala Inform Player Review, the Argentinian who plays in the top flight for Nantes in France. We've got the stats coming up on the screen right about now. He's got a 63 pace and an 82 shooting, 66 for passing, 75 dribbling, 64 defending, and a big 86 in regards of physical. Freestyle weak foot and freestyle skill. He has the high high work rate. Is six foot two. The traits and specialties coming up right about now for this Argentine. He has the engine and strength specialties and the power header trait. Pros and cons for this striker are his finishing. He's very very good in and around the box, whether it be with his left or right foot. He generally gets his shots on target and uh, gets a few goals. He links really well. His passing's pretty good to say it's only 66, and so linking him with other players around him, he's very good to get the ball into his feet and then passed on. And he's very very good in the air. Heading is one of his definitely his specialties. The cons for this player are definitely the lack of skill moves. Doesn't really have any of those, so if you're looking for skill, go elsewhere. And the fact he is very, very slow, even for a target man, no sweat here. And the work rates being obviously high, high mean a lot of the time you'll want this guy in positions where he can win his headers, get his shots away, and he's going to be further down the field. Yes, it helps him link up really well, but for me, a striker needs to be in that area more than he needs to be back in midfield. So let's get on to the highlights. So as you can see there, he can get into positions when he needs to. Uh, sadly, it's not really enough, but when he does get in those positions, he's very much good in front of goal. He's good with his feet. He's very, very good in the air as well. And a lot of the time, you want him in those positions a lot more than he tends to be. Because he's got the high, high work rates, he does drop far too deep at times, which means you do lose out on this sort of finishing. So when he's up there, he's definitely a very potent threat but when he's not he links up well but sadly you miss that edge that you'd get from some strikers for that i'm going to give him a nice seven out of ten it is pretty low but it's just because the fact is he does find himself far too far back and the fact he doesn't have that pace a lot of the time he can get caught up behind the play and for me that's a downsize on any striker hopefully you're going to try him out if you do let me know how it goes off if you've enjoyed the video like subscribe and comment i've been dango i'll catch you all later guys